Many students are thinking about heading back to school. Many of them are also learning some lessons over the past couple of months from their summer jobs. As Gil Tucker shows us, it took an accident to get the ball rolling for two young entrepreneurs. It's a great way to relax. Oh, yeah! But a few games ago here at the Chinook Bolodrome, things suddenly turned stressful for Rebecca Shidlowski. I just like lunged like this, and it just like, zoop, and I looked down, and it was all ripped right there, and I couldn't believe it because it was my favorite pair of jeans. Split beyond repair, she quickly wraps up the game. I kind of thought, well, I don't really know what to do with these jeans now. But when she gets home, inspiration strikes. You know what? I could actually use these around a headband. Why not? We'll see what we can do with it. So 19-year-old Rebecca and her 15-year-old sister Mary get down to work. The jeans are just the start. The fabric I'm using now is actually from an old cushion. This is made out of an old shirt. The old kilt, and that's made of the old tie. Turning out headbands in their cramped home workshop. We call this our sweatshop. Because <laughs> it literally gets to be like 40 degrees in here with the humidity. Yeah. A company they call Halo Hair Accessories. A halo around your head, and it could be like a headband. Everyone deserves a halo. A lot different than most summer jobs. Doing this, you actually have to figure out how to make it work. Bowling over their customers. Drumming up most business through their website and home parties. And there was this giant like, and I was like, oh no. But it's a story that hits home with their fellow bowlers. Oh, for him. And even though they may not buy, <laughs> you never know where it could lead. Got a couple granddaughters. I love these. Hoping to strike it rich. Accidentally finding something that's right up their alley. Something bad can be turned into a positive. Yeah! Gil Tucker, Global News.